Hi, welcome back to Alpha Protocol. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Like, I rounded the corner and I was like, oh, cool, nothing's happening here. And then it was just like, bullet storm. Uh, welcome back, guys. We are here with Al Alpha Protocol, the espionage RPG. We are Mike Thornton and we are trying to shut down Sharid and stop him from blowing up America, as best as I can tell. So, welcome back, guys. We're wearing the tracer glasses. How's, uh, how's everyone doing? How was your weekend if this airs on a Monday? Or how's your week going if it airs on a, any other day? Let me know in the comments down below. It looks like all that's left is to shut down that computer right here. Or hack. I'm like, and I guess this will lead us to wherever Shahid is. I f like, I really hope that is that his name is Shahid. Because it's just like, man, I don't remember that. If that's what his name is. I don't offend anybody. Shout out to any Middle Eastern viewers I have. You guys are dope. Looks like there's a small train near the rear of the... Oh, uh, okay. I remember what's happening now. It's about to get fucking intense. <laughs> Back down we go. Navigate graveyard. We level up yet again or what? Let's take a look at our intel. Or service record, rather. Just real quick. I just want to see where we are. God. Why would they make it the color of a thing? Okay, so... It looks like I either have a thousand more to go, or six thousand more to go. So, either way, fucking great. Bam! Oh, fucker! He beat me to the punch. All right, 90 meters. Metris. Let's open that door. I guess this is what's Get the awareness going so we can see everybody. Looks like four. This dude clearly knows we're here. Got him. Yes! Sometimes glitches are a good thing. This guy's coming for us. We are screwed. Maybe if I aim at him, we'll be alright. If I can, like, pick him off, maybe. Although not if he's right in front of a fucking camera. Oh, maybe. Stealthy boys! Ah, uh, but now everyone knows. Fuck. Still only four of them, though, so as long as they don't activate the alarm, I might be alright. Oh, come on with that! Come on with that! Shit, he's going for the alarm. Fucker! Now they're just gonna spawn from the fucking walls. What little walls there are. God. Alright, let's deactivate this shit real quick. One, two, nope. Two, three, four. Done. Dunzo. I really wish I had awareness going so I can see where everybody is. Maybe I can glitch through the. No. Shield's building back up. Where the fuck is everybody? Well. Like, where are they? Is there, like, up? Okay, there's one. Okay. Alright, that should be the end of them. Let's heal up in here. So how are you guys doing? Hope you're uh, just as pumped about almost catching Al Shahid as I am. Got a bomb, I guess. That's cool. Hope I'm not missing anything. Now I'm just like so pumped about finally getting out of fucking Saudi Arabia. God damn it! <laughs> like I shouldn't even be that frustrated about a little load, but fuck me. Great. Okay. 
Fuck you! Oh, money roll. Dollar dollar bill, y'all. Tiger Tiger Woods, y'all. Shout out to anybody who saw Down to Earth. <laughs> where where Chris Rock came back as like a rich white dude. And then tried to get his stand-up career going. What I What I hate about that movie though is the ending where it's like Hey, we found you a body that's an up-and-coming comedian. You can go in his body. And Chris Rock's like, great, I'll be able to go back and communicate with the girl I fell in love with and all this shit. And then it's like, well, no, you're going to be in his body, but it's basically just like walking around Earth, and you're just going to be trapped in this vessel till he dies, and then you come back to heaven. And then it's like, why? Why would anyone want that? Fuck me. Fuck me! Woo! Sneaky boys! Sneaky boys on patrol. Looks like I found some stuff. But it's just like... Why wouldn't you just stay in heaven where it was like great and everyone was having a party and shit? Because, like, the whole premise was, like, he gets, I think he gets hit by something or, and taken away. And then it's like, no, you weren't supposed to take him, you idiot. You are supposed to take someone else. Like, his name was, like, Mike Jones or something. It's like, you were supposed to take Mike P. Jones, not Mike C. Jones. It was like, ah, oh, shit, my bad. I think, like, Eugene Levy was, like, the angel. <laughs> anyway, if it's on Netflix, which I don't think it is, check it out. If you can find a way to check it out, check it out. It's... It's pretty decent. Bam. Blah now. Everybody's freaking out. Nope. Zoom is not what I want right now. Just trying to see if there's anybody else I need to pick off. The sniper rifle is a weird mechanic because it's obviously like you don't get to keep it, it's not yours. It's just here. What the fuck? Oh, hey, dude. <laughs> About to overload some generators, though. Crash some jennies. Oh, come on. I clearly meant that one. <laughs> Who's shooting at us? Hmm. There he is. That should have taken him out, I feel. Yeah, alright. God damn it. Set off the fucking alarm. What'd you do that for, bro? Shut that shit off. Oh, it shut itself off? How's that? Weird that it shut itself off. It's weirding me out, bro. Pick this lock and get in this room and wrap up the episode, cause time's almost up. Got a visual on the missiles. It looks like they're being loaded into a convoy outside the warehouse. You need to get to it before they roll out. Once they roll out. Alright, wrapping up this episode so I can start the next one super quick. Alright guys, uh, be good to yourself, be good to each other, and I will see you in like five seconds. Later days, guys.